What's up guys, this is Cody here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you a new tweak that was just updated for iOS 7 called Favorite Contact 7. Now what this is going to allow you to do is just swipe down on your notification center and on your Today tab you're actually going to have a widget that's going to allow you to tap on your favorite contacts and you can either call, message, or email them depending on your settings. So you can see right here if I tap on this one we have message. I think I have an email here somewhere. Maybe it's on this one. This is actually kind of tricky over here. You'll notice that if you don't have a picture assigned to the contact, you're not going to be able to see even a circle where that contact is. Now I'll show you a little trick that's going to allow you to uh, actually see where to tap, obviously. But you can see there's nothing there, but if I tap right there, I still get the options to call, message, or email. So let's jump into the settings here and I'll show you exactly what you can do with this. So we'll scroll down here and tap on that. You can see you can show names and show last names. Now I haven't had any uh, success with this. Every time that I toggle this on it actually jumps into safe mode. So there is an issue there. It may be just on my iPhone 5S. I'm not sure if this is an issue on the iPhone 5 but I'm sure that this will be fixed in an update. So also down here you can show labels, which is what I was talking about, actually can get you uh, some reference as to where the contacts are. So you can see it says main, mobile, home, mobile, home right there. And if you swipe over here, then you can see a little label right there that says home. So you'll know exactly where to tap. So it is a little glitchy, but hopefully it'll be fixed soon. Also, you can have show five contacts toggled on, which I do. Also page indicators, which you saw right there. You saw the page indicators and this is five contacts and here are the alert options so if I just toggle these off you'll see that it's only going to ask for a mail and the standard action is always text so if I swipe back over here tap on this you're gonna see that we can tap on a contact that actually has email we'll tap over here then you can see email right there and it's going to launch the email so if we jump back out of this and go back into the settings you can see if we have all these toggled off and you have a standard action this is what it's going to do when you tap the icon. It's not going to give you any type of alerts or anything like that. So if I swipe down here and we tap on this, you're going to see it's going to automatically open up a new iMessage so you can send a message. So this is a really cool tweet. It allows you to quickly get to your favorite contacts and communicate with them however you want. So hopefully the names will be fixed in a future update where you can actually see those and they won't crash your device. And maybe they can add a default icon for the picture that way if you don't have a picture for your contact then it still is going to show up right there in the notification center so let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button if you want to see more of my videos then go ahead and subscribe all right guys until next time this is cody with iphonehacks.com